Hey everybody, this is Rhino and we're back to the dig. So, I've said it before, but I feel it may be true this time. I felt it was true last time I said it too, but with no items that we really haven't used now, besides the jawbone, everything else is lined up really nicely. I think we may be close to the end. We just made this island appear. Uh, Maggie was able to translate the tablet and make this thing appear so we can now walk to it and see what it does. I could have sworn that this scene was just extra and had this nothing in it. Brought back from another dimension. So the island was brought back from another dimension. This island was brought back from another dimension. Well, what else do we do on the island? Opening. There we go. And what was so important that they left us exact instructions on how to get here? Maybe that metal plate over there. Well, we started this whole thing with metal plates, and we're going to end this whole thing with metal plates, I think. That's the fourth one. If it's like the metal plates on Attila, these four should fit together in that triangle matrix. Yes, but there's no guarantee that putting them together will take us anywhere we want to go. You have the most cheerful thoughts, Ms. Robbins. If you had been abducted by a monster and then half drowned, you might be pessimistic too. But you lived, didn't you? And your hair looks terrific. <laughs> you sure know how to make a girl feel good. We'd better go find Brink again. In case these metal plates do the job. He threatened to kill me the last time I saw him. Maybe it would be safer if we leave him and send an expedition back to get him later. An armed expedition. There's no guarantee we'll ever get back. For all we know, this is a one-way trip. You're right. We can't leave him. He scares me, Boston. Darn. Worse than the monster. They're both just hungry for something. But Brink is smarter. More dangerous. We're smart, too. Let's go. So we got the piece. There's nothing else in this area at all. It seems. So we gotta go deal with Brink. And then... We will... Uh, potentially go home. So there's no real reason not to s continue speeding up uh, the walking. So just double click on where we're going to go and go there. An that was a powerful one. Come on the low. Can you hear me? Yeah. Brink, we're looking for you. We've got the last of the metal plates and we... Listen to me, Commander. I'm trapped. I need your help. Where are you? It's near one of the light bridges. An arched bridge over a waterfall and then into a crevice in the rock. You must have been there. You're the one who's been turning on all the light bridges, aren't you? Hold tight. We're on our way. Hold tight? Very funny. Hmm. So, he needs our help now. Let's go help him. So that is the planetarium spire. And he's just over here to the right. In the crevice. Another area we haven't done anything in yet. You've just got your hand jammed in the rock? I thought you were in real trouble, Brink. Uh, when would it be real trouble, Commander? When it's your hand? I don't go sticking my hand in the cracks. I was reaching for a life crystal, and then the rock shifted. My circulation is cut off. No blood is getting to my hand. 
You can't pull me out, Commander. Don't leave me to die here. Even if you have to cut off my hand. Don't be so dramatic, Brink. Nobody's going to cut off your hand. Don't yeah. make promises you might not be able to keep, Maggie. Are you serious? He's just got a stuck hand. It's a race to see whether gangrene kills him before he dies of thirst or starvation. You'd cut it off. Of course he would. The military trains you to recognize necessity and do it. It would be easier if I had anything to cut it with. Chew it off then! Oh, Ew. I would break. But human teeth can't bite through bone. After all that's happened to us, this may be the most horrible. Do something, Commander! Do it now! Hmm. Okay, what do we have? We got a jawbone. And it is the one item we haven't used up to this point. <sighs> jawbone, I think. Sure you're not just holding on to the crystal? You're going to saw off his hand with a jawbone? The teeth are razor sharp. What about anesthetic? Do it, Commander! Brace yourself, Brink. I can't believe you endured so much pain without fainting. I'm fine. But I need more crystals. Come with us to the Triangle Matrix. We've got all the metal plates. You think it's gonna take us home? You don't know where it's going to take you. I'd rather gather more life crystals. What if it does take us home, Brink? What if we can't come back and get you? Do you want to stay here forever? Then what will happen to your research into the life crystals? Yes, I see your point. I'll go with you to try out these metal plates. But if it doesn't get us home, then you two will stop interfering with me from then on. All right? You See, he seems so much. Deal. Seems pretty reasonable, guy. All right, all for right. for somebody that keeps saying it's crazy, it's like he seems quite amen amenable. Just a slightly differing opinion. See, and what's gonna be funny is it's just gonna probably open the open that door next to it and go to another spire that should do it do what what's happening nothing is happening that's what that's not exactly nothing Frank. It's a door. You think Earth is on the other side? I think nothing is on the other side. What did you expect? The Tooth Fairy to come and fly us all home? The door opened. Let's go see what's in there. We had a deal. I came, these metal plates did not take us home, and now you will have to leave me alone forever. Fine, leave you them alone forever. You your word, and I expect you to keep it. He is definitely insane. Is that your opinion as a journalist? It's my opinion as a sane person. So, I don't think there's anything else here. It's just another tram thing. Like can't even walk on this side. The same area decorated and drawn slightly different. Four or five different times. Nice. This may be the first time she's ridden a tram. Well, probably not. But it may be the first time 
in me actually controlling it and having her follow me that she's walked into a tram. So off to the final spire, which I imagine there's not going to be much of anything there. It's just going to be the final light bridge to turn on. No comment? No statement at all? Feels like there should have been a comment. Okay, whatever. There's nothing here. Move on. I saw something like this in the museum display. This machine was the greatest of the inventor's achievements. What does it do? I haven't the faintest idea. Do you think it might send us home? Right now it's doing nothing. I don't recall seeing anything in the museum display that looked anything like this. We've got a strange object, we've got a console, we've got a strange object. Over here, it seems like there's like a strange object here, a cons controls. This thing is going to be complicated, isn't it? It's going to be like three puzzles. Hmm. Now it's just moving. Now it stopped moving. Okay, let's try the console. Gap in the machine. Looks like there's a part missing here. There's a gap. So we're looking for a green triangle piece. Let's go look at this console. It's a row of crystalline devices. Let's, I guess, work our way up. This control. I don't know how to work these controls. Yeah, no, no surprise. No surprise there at all. Here's an alien device. Here's a strange object. Here's a strange object. And they just change in the geometric shapes. It looks pretty bad by today's standards. Probably mind-blowing amazing when the game came out. Let's get this alien device here. Up and then up we go this crazy spiral. I don't know what to do with this device. Then let's just walk outside. Is there anything more? Here. So unless Brinks has the green piece somehow, I have no real interest or desire or reason to go bug him. Just leave him alone. Let him be left. Really, he died at the beginning of this mission anyways. It's, you could just say he died, fell in, falling down a hole, be telling the complete truth, and Sorry. never mentioning anything else. You'll have to find a new home. First bird we've seen. Here's a strange device. was already set up correctly so we can just exit now we have everything set up doesn't look like there's anything more to the left here so yes we have that strange device but 
I don't think there's anything more to see. All five of them now have been formed and we're seeing what looks like a gateway in the middle of this. It doesn't look safe to walk there. Hmm. Let's talk to Robert. Robert. Brink? As worried as I am for Brink, I can't help feeling a little angry at him. He's wacko. Nuts. Out of his mind with This food. one's new. He's not himself. It's those damn crystals. Alien device. I've got to try and turn on the inventor's machine. It's the only way to find out what it does. What do we do? Search all these islands for a part when we don't even know what it looks like? Where are all those helpful hints now? The hints were about things they deliberately hid to keep them safe. But this missing part, what if it was stolen or just corroded away? Then all of this would be for nothing. <laughs> Boston, somebody knows what the missing part does and maybe even where it is. Well, I don't know. I wasn't talking about you. I was talking about somebody who was sealed in a crystal pyramid. Oh yeah, we could just go ask him. Shouldn't we? Couldn't we? What if I hadn't noticed that inscription and taken it with me? We could have wandered around here until we died without ever finding that island. That's true. They hide it. Then they help us find it. Who can understand why aliens do what they do? Maybe it's a test of our intelligence. Or maybe it's a test of our dumb luck. <laughs> or our persistence. Maybe dumb luck is more valuable. In the After seeing what they've done to Brink, we'd better think long and hard before we start duplicating these back on Earth. Don't worry, we're probably never going back there. And even I if we do, I doubt anyone will ever be able to figure out this alien science. A lot of repeats on right. this stuff. I'm getting a lot of repeats of dialogue just because I'm not Robert. sure if there's going to be something new there or not. Never mind. So we need to go to the tomb spire. That's called the cathedral spire. And then Robins. No, stop talking to Robins. Never mind. Go back down and talk to the guy again. And maybe now he'll give me the one bit of information cuz we had the we exhausted all the conversation with the alien, and it really didn't help anything at all. So this must have been the one key thing I couldn't ask then that I can ask now. But it really feels like we're close to the end, so I'm trying to rush a little bit towards the end so we can not end up going an hour on accident. This on this. It won't do anything. On this. And then. Glowing crystals on the alien corpse. Third time we've revived this guy. Probably needed to revive him twice in the game at minimum. Speak. Ask about the island and then ask about the alien device. The island we found, where was it hidden? It left this reality, but only a little way. It can come back, because it never fully left. The island moves in and out of our reality? It loses substance with every passage. Hmm. We thought we could take our world with us into space time six. It could not be done. When something leaves our reality, where does it go? To a place where time is infinite in all directions. But because it does not move along a single line, it can never be predicted or controlled. Those who go there from here cannot change anything. 
They are nothing but observers. Forever. This whole space time six sounds like hogwash to me. I mean, I really can't get into it. Really can't believe it. It it seems seems like a, a MacGuffin if I've ever heard it. Heard the machine in your laboratory. What does it do? Where the lights all shine, it opens the eye. The eye. Does that mean the crystal at the meeting place of the light bridges? The machine generated this eye. The eye sees into all space and time. And where the eye sees, the mind can fly. Was this eye the doorway into the place where your people went? A door that can be crossed only one way. You don't know that. If someone has a strong enough tie to reality... You think you are stronger than all my people? Even they, the strongest race known, could not overcome the temptation before it was too late. If we bring your people back to this world, then they can build a starship to take us home to Earth. It's our only chance. Maybe we'll fail, but you must let us try. Since you think you are stronger and wiser than my people, I will let you have the fruit of your pride. I will tell you how to find the peace I hid, if you know how to ask. But it will cost you more than you ever imagined. Hmm. So now we can finally ask for the eye part. Please, don't play any more games with us. Where is the missing piece? You cannot understand what will begin if you activate the eye. You cannot bear to pay what it will cost you. Yes, you've warned us. Now where is the peace? Go to the map with this message and see what it shows you. see a message there. I have said enough. Go to the map with this message and see what it said. When you say the eye will see, you aren't talking hmm. about our eyes, are you? An eye that can see the three dimensions of time, as well as the three dimensions of space. It will show you beauty beyond belief. So... But once you have seen space-time six, Will you ever see space-time four again? The eye may be open, but the mind hasn't the strength to see. Thank you for helping us. Help yourselves by giving up. Never look into the impossible eye. You don't have the strength to return from that place. What was the message? We have to go to the map? I did not follow. He, he seemed like he, he motioned something, but it didn't seem like he was drawing with his hands enough of symbols so up we go to the map room and hopefully we have what we need map spire and here we go again and whatever it's going to show me do I have some new object? Not really. Panel. Let's talk to Robbins. Robbins. You get the idea that he really doesn't want us to succeed in repairing his machine. Let's just find the missing piece. But... 
Do you get the idea that he really doesn't want us to succeed in his machine? Let's just find the missing piece. Okay. We've got to try and turn on the inventor's machine. It's the only way to find out what it does. What do we do? Search all these islands for a park when we don't even know what it looks like? Where are all those helpful hints now? The hints were about things they deliberately hid to keep them safe. But this missing part, what if it was stolen or just corroded away? Then all of this would be for nothing. Boston, somebody knows what the missing part does. Let's see, let's ask a question, let's say a no, I don't statement. I wasn't talking about you. I was talking about somebody who was sealed in a crystal pyramid. You still hanging in there? I'm okay, Boston. Don't worry about me. The only other thing I can think of is going to be you, Brick. But I'm starting Brink. to get tired. I've done a lot of digging. And I've done so much reading, my eyes ache. He's a living encyclopedia. All right. Thanks. This, like the four colors here, don't make sense because this is orange and this is purple, and that's not even one that would make sense. It, it seems kind of strange, actually. There's no blue key. Do we use this tablet with the panel? It won't do anything. Do we use this engraved rod? With the panel? I can't use these two things together. Can we just use this engraved rod? It won't do anything. This. Hmm. Let's see. Like, I didn't hear or say, see any message that locks into what they were saying. Like, if I go back here, maybe the code is hidden this way. I don't know what to do with this device. This strange object here. When I touch it, does it change into a shape we'd recognize? No. So, I don't see a code in that either. I think for one last time I may have to just enter a read a walkthrough again, sadly. Get away from here! I won't let you break my life crystal machine! We don't want to break anything. My machine isn't working yet. Yes, gloat if you want to. I've studied all the inscriptions. Maggie's not the only one who can decipher strange languages. I followed the plans I found, but there's still something missing. And without it, the machine won't work. So if you think you can steal my life crystals again, Commander Lo, think again. I'll kill you first, and believe me, no one will ever revive you. 
Actually, you robbed me twice, and I only robbed you once. <laughs> so you're still one ahead. Don't joke with me! Don't joke with him, Boston. I won't stand here back. and let you distract me from my achievements. The There's iPhone. this piece that we think will restart the eye. I don't care about whatever trivial tasks are keeping you occupied. Have you seen the large machine in the laboratory? It is a meaningless toy compared to what I am working on. Interesting. What do you? I don't have time to waste on foolish discussion of nothing. So he doesn't seem to care about any of it. Thanks for helping me save Maggie. Hmm. You've already rewarded me by being a pushover, Commander. Hmm. <laughs> We're on the verge of opening a gateway in the fabric of reality. If it works, we think it might lead us home. Yes, you and Maggie can go home. You think it doesn't I don't seem know like, secretly plan to leave me like I'm gonna figure it out. For There's something I'm supposed to do at the mag map room, and I didn't catch what it was. Why do I bother? Talking to you is a waste of time. It seems like Brink is still working on his machine, but he's not really being a problem. Hey, I can finally save again. So we are only up to save number nine, and that's only because so often the game has simply not allowed me to load the save screen. Anywho, that's going to be it for this recording. I'm going to go check the walkthrough. Probably next time will be the last time. And hopefully it's not like five minutes and then we're done with the entire series. But it may be. Anyways, as always, I ask you to like, share, subscribe comment if you want to and watch every second of my videos all that helps out if you want to support me you can click on my name righto on the right will be a blue button that says support this channel click it make a donation and if you want a friend or follow me on basically any social media sites there's a whole bunch of links down below thank you for watching have a good evening